I'm Stu uh, from The Twang, uh, we're here at Brixton Academy. I'm Saunders from The Twang, I'm John from The Twang, and uh, yeah, we're just in the first aid room at the moment. I'm Phil from The Twang. Hi, I'm Matty from The Twang, we're at Brixton Academy, for some strange reason, I'm in the girls' toilets. <laughs> to come down here is it's just it's another it's another sort of milestone and it's um, unbelievable man. I can't believe that we sold it out as well. I mean last time we played here was with James a few months ago. We're pretty honoured really to be playing a place like this. It's uh, it's just an achievement. It's good. It's compliment eh? It's good man. What is wrong with him? What is wrong with him? Well, it looks alright to me, man. Are you diagnosed? A bit of a fat head. Fat head, <laughs> fat head man. Neon Twang, we had to change the name because a lot of the venues that we played at, there was a lot of trouble always there. We're still Neon Twang, you know, as far as I'm concerned. We ended up getting banned from a lot of venues because of the crowds coming to see us, basically mates and that, causing loads of trouble. I was in Neon Twang and I'm in the Twang, so we're still Neon Twang, you know, as far as I'm concerned. I might drop this look on stage tonight. I'm doing exactly what I've always wanted to do with my life. To be a doctor. Yeah, that's what I was going to do if I weren't a musician. I don't know what I'd, I'd, I don't know what I'd do, man. It's hard to say, and I'd probably be doing a shit job like what I did before. So mm -hmm. I don't know, man. It's hard to say, it, man. But the, you know, this is what we wanted to do for years, man. So we concentrated on this. You know what I mean? How lucky are we to be doing this? It's just it's immense, you know. When it goes tits up, then we'll go back to doing shit jobs again. <laughs> The worst habit. Oh. Stu smokes too much. I drink too much. <laughs> mate, well, for telling stories, mate, it's fucking. Leave that to a comedian, innit? Well, I think it was in Middlesbrough. I tried to like jump off the stage and almost broke my foot. That's quite embarrassing, because the next day I did look a bit of a twat when I couldn't walk. But it's getting there now. I've got my brace on, look. I've got my brace on. It gets, it gets me through the gigs, along with vodka. But, uh, no, not really, man. I don't know. I'm sure, I'm sure when you ask Matty, save that one for him. He's got plenty of embarrassing stories, and <laughs> I was talking absolute. It was, uh, I was in Germany. I ended up getting a bit drunk, basically. And I was sharing a hotel room with someone else. And uh, there was like these chocolates on the, on the pillows. You know, I don't know, you know what I mean. And, um, well, I woke up in the morning and I must have well, obviously, I shit myself. <laughs> I was that because I was that drunk, and uh, I thought he'd put a chocolate in my pants because I was that pissed. I was like, he woke me up. He's like, "What's that on, your, on the covers?" I thought it was some pattern or something. I was like, I sniffed it and it was shit. One of the first things I woke up to this morning was hearing that he, he had to throw his pants out the fucking skylight, man, because he'd shit himself. So fucking disgusting. But I tend to. Uh, do stuff like that, but I have too much to drink. Dirty little cunt. See you later. Have a good gig. Bye. 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 Goodbye. Hi, I'm Matty from The Twang. We're at Brixton Academy. You're watching enemy.com. See you later. I'll push you out the ghost forever.